embark on a journey through the pages of unexplained history, a portal to mysteries that even the sharpest scientific minds can't fully unravel. This video explores 25 of the most baffling real photos that scientists can't explain. Number 25. A Picture of the Future Who would have thought that the most real battles on social media could be marked by just one 400-year-old painting? A Dutch artist painted this marvel, called Portrait of a Boy. Some critics claim it depicts the artist's eight-year-old son, while others see it as the son of a wine merchant. But it's not him that's attracted attention. It's his shoes. The most attentive among you have already noticed one obvious similarity to the brand of our days. I'm talking about Nike, of course. In the pair of shoes, black Nike sneakers with a distinctive logo in the shape of a tick were recognized. It'd be fine, but the picture was painted in 1652, and the athletic shoe company wasn't founded until 312 years after that, in 1964. But how could a thing from our time be in the past? Maybe time machines do exist after all. Of course, no one will give us an exact answer, so we can only guess and stand on one side of the debate or the other. Personally, it seems to me that if a time portal does exist, people probably wouldn't move some shoes there. So, I'm inclined to believe that this is just a coincidence. Number 24. Parallel World There are strange and mysterious photos that raise questions, but you have to admit that a picture is much easier to fake. It's not the case with video footage. Creating a plausible video fake is much more difficult. Next, I'll show you how passenger caught Parallel World on camera. Several years ago, a passenger on an airplane flying over the U.S. filmed an unusual picture, a mysterious hole in the sky. As you can see, the hole shimmers and shines in the light. The video drew the attention of scientists as well as ufologists and conspiracy theorists. While some suggested that it was just a normal celestial phenomenon, others thought that the passenger had filmed a portal into a parallel world or a harbinger of the coming apocalypse. Nearly four years passed, and the apocalypse didn't happen, so maybe it really was a portal to another world that opened. Number 23. Phantom Girl. Have you ever taken one or more photos, looked at them, thought everything was fine, and then, when you look at them again, you notice a discrepancy, some nuance that bothers you? Well, a similar thing happened with photos taken 100 years ago. In 2015, Krasnyarsk Regional Museum of Local History in Russia received a request for photos of the sites of Krasnyarsk taken during the reign of Emperor Nicholas II of Russia. During the search, the museum workers were struck by a strange fact. In many photos, they found the same girl. She had a sad face everywhere she was, also wearing the same clothes. Since the photos were completely different, taken from different angles and from different distances, we can conclude that the author of the photos didn't photograph the girl. She appeared in the photos herself. In all the photos, she's 8 to 10 years old. She's always wearing a hat and holding an umbrella. The girl's wearing a beautiful white dress and coat. She has a long black braid with a ribbon, which is always thrown over her shoulder. The only thing people have noticed is that she has different boots in different photos, but what remains constant is her sullen expression. It's a look that gives you chills. Local historians compared the photos with the way the buildings in different places looked 100 years ago and suggest that most likely, the photos were taken from 1906 to 1908. Curiously enough, the girl didn't change at all during this time, as if she was not alive. People immediately began to study the pictures, or rather, to determine their author, but it wasn't possible to do this. The pictures were also checked a lot of times. Some people were sure that this was all editing and fiction made for one purpose, to attract tourists. However, later, it turned out that there was no editing in the case of these pictures. People agreed that this is a real phantom girl who is either dead and cannot find a resting place, or she's a ghost of the city, always watching its residents. Number 22. Freddy Krueger. Here's another strange photo that no one can explain. It shows three children having fun in the company of their parents. The adults wanted to take a photo to remember but never imagined that along with this, they would catch someone incredibly scary on camera. The creepy silhouette of the famous Freddy Krueger appeared behind the kid. Of course, the first thing that comes to mind is that the whole thing is a fake, but the most experienced editing experts proved otherwise. None of the professionals could find a single trace of editing. So, the Elm Street killer is real. Number 21. Smartphones in paintings. After studying old pictures or ancient paintings, one feels somehow uncomfortable. Not only because of the fact that life was very different from our modern life, but also because of the realization that we may be living in an illusion or under someone's supreme control. Why do I have such bad thoughts? It's all because of ordinary pictures that were painted back in the 19th or early 20th century. Back then, none of the people had any idea about the smartphone. In fact, people didn't even know what a usual cell phone was. However, 
One of the pictures clearly shows a couple standing by the riverbank and handing each other a dark rectangle with rounded corners, reminiscent of an early iPhone model. Conspiracy theorists from all over the world immediately remembered the theories about time travel. And you know, for some reason, I believe it a little. Here's another picture painted a little later. It shows Native Americans, and one of them is holding an object that looks a lot more like an iPhone. The Native American seems to be holding a smartphone in the same way that we do when we're browsing social media or playing video games. And if you think the phone version sound too strange, and it could have been absolutely anything, just assume it actually was the case. After all, normal versions simply didn't exist. As it turns out. Number 20. Possessed picture. Do you think any filters were used in the photo you're looking at right now? I think that even the most inexperienced editor or a person who's never worked with effects in their life would say yes. But the interesting thing about this picture is that they're not actually there at all. Experts have studied the negative of the shot and made a startling statement. According to them, the picture depicts negatively charged energy entities, in other words, demons. The conclusion of experts was unanimous. The man in the photo is possessed by horrible creatures. The story of the picture, by the way, is quite simple and understandable. A man came to take a photo for a document, but after printing it out, he and the photographer saw this. I agree, it sounds unbelievable, but the fact that experts have confirmed the authenticity of the picture makes one horrified. Number 19. Goddard Squadron. In every organization and in every class, taking a group photo is an important thing. But what if the group photo includes people who were never meant to be there? What if the group photo shows those who were meant to be in the realm of the dead? This is the Goddard Squadron photo, and to this day, it remains one of the most unusual photos in the world. World War I, 1919, and we have Goddard Squadron, a group of brave British airmen. One day, they gathered for a group photo. Among them is Freddie Jackson, a mechanic. Unfortunately, tragedy struck, and Freddie died just before the photo was taken. So, how come the man was seen standing behind his peers when the photograph was developed? The squadron was floored. How could their departed comrade make an appearance in a photograph? Skeptics called foul play, suggesting it was a trick or a double exposure. But those who knew Freddie vouched for the authenticity of the image. They said it was definitely their fallen colleague, forever captured in that eerie snapshot. Number 18. Nursing Home Ghost. In fact, the story of strange pictures is far from an uncommon topic, especially in this day and age, when the world of technology is full of opportunities to distinguish a real picture from a fake one. There are plenty of weird shots out there, but some of them stand out in this weird and scary general background, and here's one of them. This photo was taken in 1997. On that day, an American woman named Denise Russell came to visit her 94-year-old grandmother, who'd been in a nursing home for only a week. They had a great time, took a lot of pictures, and planned to meet again. But unfortunately, the grandmother didn't live long, and by the time of their next meeting, she had already passed away. Because of the burial process and grief, no one touched these photos. Nobody cared about them. But when the moment came, people noticed one strange thing. Behind the back of the grandmother, a man was clearly visible, who was similar to their grandfather, like two peas in a pod. That is, it was the woman's husband, and the problem was that he had died 13 years before this photo was taken. What's interesting is that the weirdness didn't end there. A cousin, who heard about this photo of the deceased grandfather, asked for the picture to be emailed to him so he and his family could look at it carefully. The next day, he called his sister and asked, Did you see the face in the branches? She told him no. Then he replied, Look just above the red car. And indeed, if you look closely, you can see some strange and unpleasant alien creature there, watching the couple intently from the side. Is this really what death looks like, which is waiting for a person to visit it? What do you think? Number 17. The alleged 1870s Billy the Kid photographs. Photographs give us a glimpse of the past, but sometimes their authenticity can puzzle historians and lead to intense debates. A captivating example is a photograph bought in 2010 for just $2 at a memorabilia shop. This photo supposedly captures the notorious outlaw Billy the Kid and his gang, the Regulators, engaging in a casual game of croquet. If genuine, it would be only the second confirmed image of Billy the Kid, skyrocketing its value to millions. However, confirming its authenticity has proven to be a challenge. Facial recognition software suggests a resemblance between the person in the known photograph of Billy the Kid and the figure in the croquet photo. Nevertheless, doubts arise due to other factors. Some historians question the likelihood of an outlaw like Billy the Kid participating in a refined activity like croquet, as it contrasts with their rough lifestyle. Despite the controversy, 
the photograph has generated significant interest. Number 16. The Mysterious Passenger Who but dead people can be associated with the most bizarre and frightening photos in history? For example, a bone-chilling story happened to another American woman who traveled with her husband to visit her mother's grave in 1959. It's unclear why, but during the trip, the people took pictures of themselves. Apparently, they wanted to remember the process as vividly as possible. So when the wife talked to her mom at her grave and started to go back to the car, she took a picture of her husband sitting there all alone. But when the photo showed up, it turned out that he wasn't actually there all alone. The couple was stunned because in the back seat was some silhouette in glasses, and the woman almost immediately recognized her mother. A photography expert who examined the picture claimed that the woman's image was neither a reflection nor a double exposure, that is, a superimposition of pictures on top of each other. Number 15. A place for witches. Look at this picture. What mood do you think it conveys? Was this where the pageants were held? Was this a place of exclusion, some kind of prison cell, or maybe an image from a movie? What you're looking at is actually a prison cell where the Salem witches were imprisoned. It's where the accused women spent their last moments before execution. Between 1692 and 1693, about 200 people were accused of witchcraft, and 19 of those found guilty were sentenced to death. You have to admit that the picture is just awful. I don't know how to explain it, but its negative energy is felt right through the screen. Not for nothing, it's so popular on the internet, because many people constantly claim that this is the only photo with a living energy. The shot allows you to plunge into the past and feel yourself in the shoes of the poor girls. Number 14. Worsted Church Ghost In the 1830s, the villagers of Worsted couldn't help but gossip about a ghostly apparition known as the White Lady. Legend has it that she pops up every Christmas Eve at the stroke of midnight inside St. Mary's Church. Spooky, right? Now, fast forward to one fateful Christmas Eve. This bold dude is hanging out with his buddies at the King's Arms pub, boasting about how he ain't afraid of no white lady. He even goes as far as challenging her, claiming he'll ring in the birth of Christ himself to prove his fearlessness. So off he goes toward the church, leaving his pals waiting to hear those bells chime, ringing in Christmas. But guess what? No sound, nada, silch. Worried sick, his friends rushed to find him and discovered the poor guy collapsed in the bell chamber, totally freaked out. With his last breath, he mutters, I've seen her. Now let's fast forward again, but this time to 1975. The white lady decided it was time for a comeback, and she had proof this time, a photograph. It was a summer's day when Diane Berthelot and her family paid a visit to the lovely village of Worsted. They had no clue about the whole ghost thing. Seeking refuge from the blazing heat, they stepped into the old church. Mrs. Berthelot, feeling a bit under the weather with an ear infection, decided to say a little prayer for some relief. Now, here's where it gets interesting. Unbeknownst to her, her sneaky husband Peter snaps a picture of her during her serene moment. The white lady herself decides to make a surprise appearance in the photo. Number 13. Demons do exist. What if there were real witches who cursed the common people or prevented them from existing in some other way? In that case, I would consider such a punishment quite justified, especially since there are other cases in history that prove the existence of such evil beings. For example, here's a picture proving that demons exist. In 2014, when the shot was first published, the internet literally exploded with reports of devils, demons, and other dark creatures being real. A comment on the photo from its author was as follows. A nurse at her post noticed something strange on the viewing monitor and managed to take a picture on her phone. When she took a closer look, she noticed a blurry, dark figure standing on a hospital bed. What's even more frightening is that the patient who was lying on the bed died an hour or two after the incident. It's believed that the camera caught death and one of its sides. Strangely enough, there are those who are convinced that this photo is absolutely normal. In their opinion, there's nothing unusual here at all. Allegedly, this is just a hospital bed, patient's legs, and medical equipment in the background. In other words, the legs could indeed belong to the patient, not to a demon, just as the devil's thigh could be the edge of the bed. However, it's not clear why a similar edge is missing on one side. Number 12. The Pyrie Reese Map The Pyrie Reese Map, named after its creator, the Ottoman admiral and cartographer Pyrie Reese, has puzzled historians and scientists for a long time. This map, drawn in 1513, is a world map that mainly focuses on the coasts of Europe and North Africa, with the Atlantic Ocean at the center and parts of the Americas and Antarctica included. The mystery lies in its surprisingly accurate depiction of certain parts of the Americas, particularly the coastline of South America. 
In 1513, Europeans didn't know much about the New World, but this map has detailed features that shouldn't be possible at that time. It's even more interesting because it shows Antarctica without ice, which hasn't happened for millions of years. How did Pyre Reese know this? The map was made from different sources, some of which were old and non-existent. Maybe these sources had maps from an ancient civilization with advanced knowledge of mapping. Skeptics say the Antarctica part of the map could be guesses or mistakes, or maybe they drew South America wrong. Some say the map just shows what sailors believed back then, not necessarily the truth. Number 11. The Unidentified Flying Object in the Madonna The unexplained often explores a fascinating idea, ancient artworks containing objects that seem out of place. One famous instance is found in a 15th century painting called The Madonna with Saint Giovannino, created by the Italian artist Domenico Ghirlandaio. The painting depicts the Virgin Mary with baby Saint John the Baptist on her left shoulder. However, what captures attention is a peculiar element in the background. In the sky, a strange glowing object is witnessed by a man and his dog. The man shields his eyes, suggesting the object's brightness. Some believe this mysterious object could be an unidentified flying object, seeing its shape, glow, and rays of light. They speculate that it might offer historical evidence of extraterrestrial life. On the other hand, skeptics argue that it symbolizes something divine, like an angel or the Holy Spirit, common in religious art of that era. Another theory proposes that it represents the Star of Bethlehem or a miraculous celestial sign. Number 10. The Anachronistic 1930s Beach Photograph Sometimes, you can find interesting mysteries in ordinary places. For instance, an old photo from the 1930s shows people having fun at a beach in British Columbia, Canada. In the midst of everyone wearing typical beach clothes from that time, there's one man who stands out. He's dressed in modern clothes, like a cool t-shirt, shorts, and a hairstyle more suited to the late 1900s or early 2000s, not the 1930s. This strange sight has led some people to think he might be a time traveler. But others who doubt this idea have simpler explanations. They say his t-shirt could actually be a rolled-up sweater, and his shorts could be rolled-up pants, both reasonable choices for a hot day at the beach. They likewise think his hairstyle could be the result of wind or wet hair and not a deliberate fashion choice from a different time. Even with these reasonable explanations, people still debate and speculate about the photo, whether the man is a real-time traveler, a fashion-forward person, or just a camera trick. We can't be sure. Number 9. The Voynich Manuscript Enigmatic Images The Voynich Manuscript, named after Wilfred Voynich, a Polish book dealer who acquired it in 1912, is a puzzling book from the 15th century. It is filled with mysterious pictures and text written in an unknown language. Even the smartest minds in the world are puzzled by it. The manuscript contains intriguing illustrations of plants, stars, women bathing, and pharmaceutical drawings. However, none of these correspond to anything we know. The plants depicted cannot be identified as any known species on Earth, and the astronomical charts don't match anything recognized by modern astronomers. Many theories have been proposed over the years, suggesting that the manuscript could be a pharmacopoeia, an alchemical text, or a work of speculative fiction. Despite numerous attempts to decode the manuscript, its text and peculiar illustrations remain a complete mystery. Number 8. Carl Tanzler and His Human Doll Carl Tanzler, a German-born radiology technician, was captivated by the enchanting Elena Helen Milagro de Hoyos, a young Cuban-American woman who sought medical treatment in Florida during the 1930s. From the moment Tanzler laid eyes on her, he was consumed by an inexplicable infatuation. Many claimed that this desire pushed Tanzler to do the unimaginable thing he did. Two years after her death, despite Tanzler's best efforts to save her, Elena tragically succumbed to tuberculosis. However, it wasn't the end for Tanzler. With his medical expertise and undying devotion, Tanzler meticulously reconstructed Elena's remains, turning her into a life-size doll. He used wires, wax, and cloth to recreate her physical form, ensuring she would forever remain by his side. For years, Tanzler lived a surreally macabre existence with his human doll, even going as far as dressing her in fine clothing and adorning her with wigs. He spent countless hours talking to her, believing that their bond transcended the barriers of death itself. But, of course, what Tanzler did wasn't left undiscovered. This eerie tale of devotion and obsession only came to light when Tanzler's secret was discovered. No one could comprehend how Tanzler's stomach slept next to a rotting corpse. Many even questioned Tanzler's sanity. Many were horrified by what Tanzler did, but many also pitied the man. After all, no DNA was found in the corpse. 
and it seemed that Tansler really saw Elena's doll as a companion. Number 7. Ghostly Image at Hampton's Court Now, this is a pretty intriguing story. You probably know about the Hampton Court Palace, the magnificent Tudor Castle near London. Well, a security camera caught something strange near its vicinity. Could it be a ghost or something else? According to Vicky Wood, the palace spokesman, the image they released is not a Christmas hoax. They're genuinely puzzled about who or what the figure in the photo might be. One of the palace security guards, James Fox, described the moment as incredibly eerie. With a haunted history and sightings of ghostly figures, the palace is buzzing with speculation. So what do you think, folks? A trick of the light or a genuine ghostly visitor? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Number 6. The 1920s Levitation Photograph In the olden days before fancy computer tricks were invented, a photograph from the 1920s caused quite a commotion in society. This photo captured a man, seemingly floating in the air, leaving everyone absolutely astonished. The man in question was Colin Evans, a spiritualist who conducted seances in the dark. During these sessions, he would use a flash camera briefly to light up the scene, and that's when the incredible picture was taken. In the photograph, Evans appears to be suspended in midair, while people around him gaze on with wide-eyed amazement. Some people who doubted its authenticity claimed that the photo was set up, possibly with hidden supports or wires. But those who supported Evans firmly believed that this picture was solid proof of his extraordinary spiritual powers. This levitation photograph of Colin Evans reminds us of how humans have forever been captivated by the supernatural. It shows the lengths people would go to in order to validate such mysterious happenings. Number 5. Ghost Pilot Sometime in 1987, a plane enthusiast named Mrs. Sayer decided to have a little fun during a visit to an airfield in England. After admiring a plane, she decided to take a photo of her sitting in the cockpit. Little did she know, her photo op would become a dreadful encounter. Mrs. Sayer swears up and down that no one, absolutely no one, was sitting beside her in the pilot seat. What's strange, however, is that when she developed the photo, she found a peculiar figure right next to her. Paranormal experts immediately asked Mrs. Sayer about her experience, and the woman claimed she recalled feeling an icy breeze tickling her spine, even though it was a scorching hot day. Now, here's where the story gets more interesting. The aircraft had a history. It saw action in the Falklands War, but we can't confirm if any pilots met their unfortunate end. So, who could this apparition be? A fallen hero? A mischievous spirit? Or maybe just a confused tourist who took a wrong turn from the afterlife? Or is it nothing out of the ordinary, and it's just a trick of the eye? Number 4. Dinosaur Eggs A group of workers from China was repairing the roads in downtown Heiyuan when they stumbled upon something truly astonishing. While digging deep into the ground, they unearthed a remarkable find, 43 old eggs, hidden away like a valuable treasure. The most mind-boggling aspect of this discovery was the age of these eggs, which had been resting undisturbed for an astounding 70 million years. Despite the passage of such an extensive period, the eggs remained surprisingly intact. In fact, 19 of them were completely whole and in excellent condition, appearing as if they had been flawlessly preserved just yesterday. Some of these eggs were enormous, measuring an impressive 13 centimeters across. Scientific researchers who examined these eggs are overwhelmed with curiosity as they endeavor to unravel the mystery of which dinosaur species they belong to. Number 3. Falcon UFO in the annals of UFO encounters, there are few incidents as bizarre and unsettling as the Falcon UFO incident. What makes this encounter genuinely remarkable is the impact it had on the victims involved. On a seemingly ordinary day in the quiet town of Falcon, Colorado, something extraordinary occurred. Multiple witnesses reported a mysterious craft hovering in the sky. The object, described as disc-shaped and glowing with another worldly aura, sent shivers down the spines of those who beheld it but it was the aftermath of the encounter that truly shocked the community. The witnesses soon found themselves experiencing inexplicable symptoms. Severe headaches, debilitating nausea, and unexplained bruises plagued them, leaving them physically and emotionally scarred. The Falcon UFO incident was not just a fleeting sighting for the victims. It was a life-altering event. As news of the incident spread, many became curious about it. Experts scrambled to find rational explanations, but their efforts fell short in the face of such enigmatic phenomena. Yet, the truth remains elusive. What was the purpose of the craft? Who or what was behind its appearance? And perhaps most importantly, why did it leave such a lasting mark on those who witnessed it? Number 2. The Soviet Psychokinetic It was the Cold War era, and amidst the political tension, 
a woman named Nina Kolegina emerged as a unique figure in the Soviet Union, known for her alleged psychokinetic powers. She captured the attention of scientists and skeptics alike. Now, let's be clear, we won't be hyping up her story with unnecessary theatrics. Instead, we'll present the facts, letting you decide what to make of this intriguing phenomenon. Nina Kolegina claimed to be able to move objects with her mind, a power known as psychokinesis. Through a series of experiments conducted in the 1960s and 1970s, she stunned researchers with her alleged demonstrations of bending spoons, levitating small objects, and even influencing the movement of compass needles. But here's the catch. Unlike some sensationalized portrayals, Kulagina's abilities were met with skepticism, and scientists sought to examine her powers under controlled conditions. They meticulously documented her sessions, observing her interactions with various objects and measuring any potential energy emissions. However, it's essential to mention that Kulagina's abilities were not without controversy. Some critics claimed that her demonstrations could be attributed to clever sleight of hand or misinterpretation of natural phenomena. Number 1. Geophone Rock Anomaly It was the last flight of Apollo 17, and it was heading toward the moon. It was then that near the Geophone Rock, a peculiar image was captured, an image initially labeled by NASA as a blank image. But if you look at the image closer, you can see in the lunar landscape what looks like pyramids. NASA never provided a credible explanation for this captivating photograph. Determined to unveil the truth, researchers took matters into their own hands, applying advanced noise reduction techniques and cranking up the contrast. They peeled back the veil of ambiguity, and lo and behold, the enhanced photo revealed the existence of pyramid-like structures scattered across the moon's terrain. But that's not all. Careful scrutiny of the image brings another curious sight to light. Nestled in the bottom left corner, a bar-like structure makes its presence known. Cataloged as AS17-135-20680, this photograph holds a place in the vast NASA multimedia library, alongside other awe-inspiring visuals from the Apollo 17 mission. Yet, despite its significance, the scientific community remains hesitant to provide a definitive explanation for these pyramid structures etched on the lunar landscape. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.